Hello guys, welcome to Tech Theory. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to enable Windows feature Hyper-V. We have two ways to do that. The first one will be to do it from PowerShell through a command and second one will be to do it graphically. So let's just move to PowerShell. You can go to start and search for PowerShell and right click on it, run as ad administrator when it is open uh, so actually the command is a bit lengthy i don't want to waste time in typing it so this is the command you have to copy it you will find it in, uh, in my video description so you don't have to look for it anywhere else now your oh, command is running and it will take a while that's why i, I didn't want to waste time on typing the thing because it will also take a bit longer so it's done and now it's asking me to restart my pc because the feature uh, is installed um, properly uh, but i will say no because i have to uh, yeah you can see here uh, it is uh, done like it is installed and now it's asking me to restart my PC but I'm avoiding this thing for now and I have to show you guys how to do it uh, kind of graphically you have to go to control panel and in control panel you can go to uh, programs and features and in program and features turn on on your left side it's third option like second from the third from top so turn windows feature on and off so in in this tab you will see a lot of features they that are like uh, additional features few of them because they are not installed and uh, the intended one the one we're talking about today it's hyper v it is installed because i have installed it from powershell but if you guys are trying to do it uh, graphically so you can do it directly here and it will be like uh, unchecked you guys have to check it and click ok it will take a while and it will install hyper v and after restarting your computer you guys will see it will be there so now so now i don't have hyper v uh, on my pc because i didn't restart my pc uh, i have to restart it now and i'll get back to you guys and i'll show you it'll be there so see you i have restarted my computer and now i'll show you guys after restarting your computer where you can find hyper v manager uh, you have to click on windows in windows you have to go to administrative tools in administrative tools you'll see hyper v manager is here so in my next video i'm gonna show you how to install a virtual machine on hyper v and i'll tell you guys how to use hyper v and how it works and all thank you so much for watching this video uh, follow my youtube channel and uh, see you in next video till that take care have a good day bye